be very wary of that. Four years ago when Scotland qualified for Euro 96, they did so by winning seven of their ten matches. This time around, though, it's a great ball in towards number nine, Kevin Gallagher, who has a shot on goal. Yes, I think he is one of the players that Scotland could utilise in their counter-attack. Pabolski, Lockvence and Schmitz away for the cross, Lockvence! Uh, for the last two days have been choked with Scottish football fans entertaining their hosts. Once again, they really have... Lockvence is on the back post, and even the beanpole Lockvence wasn't able to get anywhere near Carroll Pugat. David Weir, it was a good touch. Durant, Durant sliding, Paul Ritchie's in there, number five, up towards Ritchie! Oh, it was a free header, what a chance for Paul Ritchie, the former Scottish schoolboy captain. Well, it was not only Paul Ritchie had the opportunity there, but he was the first of a pair of Scotland players who went in, it was a marvellous ball played in by Durant, and Paul will look at that, and I think... Kowalski, the referee's allowed the advantage, it's a good ball in by Davidson, Lockvence, Ned Vied, Good defending by Scotland. Yemets, Nedviet is on side. Durant. That's a free kick. Well, that's the third foul, maybe by different pairs. Dodds! Oh, a save by Cernicek. And another great opportunity. It was a shot on target by Billy Dodds, who comes close to his fourth international goal. Well, it came about from the throw. I think there was a switch here with Alan Johnson. He got his cross in. And Billy Dodds towards Lock Vance. It wasn't a great ball. Remember, Scotland started very brightly indeed in the match at Celtic Park against... It's Berger! What a clever free kick. He spun off the defensive wall. Czech Republic. Lock Vance is in. Lock Vance. Oh, a fine save by Sullivan. Dreadful error by Scotland. And their goalkeeper... Oh, that was a dangerous kick by Hasek. Helps it on. There's an opening here for Scotland. Johnston! And it's whipped off the end of his toe by Pavel Cernicek. Another good opening by Scotland. It was especially with Billy Dyer's repair. Grant. Davidson. That's another hefty challenge by Hornyak. That's a nasty tackle, Gary. That deserves a bit of Another kick of the checks off the hook. Durant with a free kick. Calderwood missed his challenge, Lambert, oh he's pulled it back, Sullivan hasn't got there, Berger, and nobody could get a decisive touch there for the Czechs. Paborski. The referee has not played the advantage, they have a free kick here, Berger whips it in, Lockfence, and it's headed straight down at Neil Sullivan, and he's had two very good chances now. Berger, Calderwood's challenge is a legal one, that is an illegal one, and the Czechs are absolutely furious. It's Davidson. Ritchie, who's there? Ritchie's in there, Ritchie scored! Scotland have the lead! And Paul Ritchie, with a dramatic header, sends the Tartan army absolutely wild! Oh, what a fantastic moment for Paul Ritchie. He had an opportunity early on in the game, then he fluffed it. But on this occasion, he gets in front of his man, attacks the ball, puts in the top. Nedviet. What a save! An extraordinary reaction save by Neil Sullivan. And leading by goal to nil, Davidson. Straight at Pavel Cernicek, and Scotland have had... Free kick to the Czech Republic. Berger to take it. Oh, it's a disappointing one. And the player... It uh, changes direction. Final ball through to Lock Vance, just over here to Neil Sullivan, who's been called into the action to make a... That's a lovely ball laid in towards Dodds. Goal kick. That was unfortunate. I mean, not only was that a good ball... That two-man... Also the last two European Championships. I should say, last two major championships as a year. Free kick to Scotland, we are... We almost got there. Terrific. 
Zed Vien, and he clear by David. Play to the back post will be for the half time whistle. Indeed, the referee, Helmut Krug, takes the teams to walk to Lee Wellings. In fact, Paul Rich's goal was a block fence, couldn't get there. Block fence! And thrashes the ball into the crowd. Hasn't scored a lot of goals at international level, just one. And this is. Lock Vence. And clear. Lock Vence. Schmitzer. Gasp of anticipation in the crowd, but Schmitzer's shot wasn't hard enough or angled wider. In a positive way. They played well, but I think the determination against a lot of decisions like that one that has gone against them. It's Nedviet. The wall stood firm. It's Nedviet again. It's Lock Vence. The corner. Sullivan hasn't got there. Just about cleared by Scotland. A goal line clearance. I think it might have been Lambert who got it. Oh, that's a very disappointing cross. Pache. Durant. Oh dear. Second goal would do nicely now. And there is a second goal. Johnston scores, and Scotland could be celebrating victory in Prague. They can't believe it. They just can't take in what is happening in front of them. Alan Johnston, who scored on Saturday in the Faroe Islands, now gives Scotland a two-goal advantage. Kuka also about to come on. And there's a goal for the Czech Republic. They're right back in it. Repka scores. It's his first international goal. And Scotland have been hit with a sucker punch. Paborski. Lock Vence was waiting unmarked inside the six. Schmitzer, it's a lovely ball. Lock Vence. And Sullivan with a fine save, first shot, block fence, Nedviet, straight at Neil Sullivan, put under tremendous pressure, that'll be a goal, Barter Prague Stadium, Berger with a free kick, Sullivan hasn't got there, and the reason he hadn't got there is because he was being fouled, it's a, and it's Sullivan's ball. Scotland have 11 players behind the wall. Ned Vied. From at 20. Kuka. As the equaliser. Pavel Kuka makes it 2 2. And the Czech Republic are back from the dead. off his line and then he stops. Cook has made a marvellous run there into the... Against it, this is Ned Vied. Old firm boys. And they did. Mitza. And that'll be goal kick there. Kuka. Going to turn Ritchie. May need support. Collot by David Weir. Collar flicks it on. And it's a goal kick. Berger. It's a goal for the big man, Collar. And he could well have taken the Czech Republic all the way to Euro 2000. Oh dear. Heartbreak for Scotland. They can hardly contain. Boy. The chicken was went the wrong way. We played a miniature of stoppage time. And then... The Czech Republic are going to the European Championship finals. They're the first team to qualify. Here's the man who scored the win.